Hello, full-time Devils fans. It is me, Jack Reeve, coming over from Talk Norwich City once again. Hope you enjoyed my preview. Today is slightly more of a deflated review of, of the game. 4-0 defeat. It's hard to take. And it's put us even closer to relegation now. It's a fantastic performance from your lads. Ryan Giggs clearly really got all, them, all the players fired up. But it must be frustrating in a way for you to see that the players can do it. They just maybe chose not to do it for David Moyes. Wayne Rooney said after the game that... That it, that it is the players' fault in a way that, that where they are. It wasn't all Moyes' fault. Of course, he has to take some blame for where you currently lie, but it's not all of yours' fault. But today, you got the job done against a pretty poor Norwich side. I mean, in my preview, if you watched it, I said that we wouldn't roll over too easily, and I couldn't have been more wrong. I've, I said that because against Liverpool last week, we looked very good. Um, a lot of grit, a lot of determination, and it looked like we were really up for, for mounting the chance of staying up this season. But today we completely let ourselves down and completely embar embarrassed ourselves against one of the best teams in England. We were expecting this game to be tough. Of course we were. It's never easy to tra travel into Old Trafford, even this season when you haven't been your best. It's, we, we're still scared of it. But we were still hoping for some kind of performance. We were still hoping for our players to get fired up because at the end of the day, these last three games determine whether we stay in the Premier League or not. And then players should be fighting for that. It doesn't come around that easily that you, you play in the Premier League. It's a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. And for us Norwich fans, we, we want to stay here. 26,000 fans every single week. It's a sellout. We take 3,000 fans to every single game. We feel let down by the players. Whitaker, the, the penalty was a bit soft. Of course it was. But we defended well first half. I was fairly happy with the first half display. We, you, I bet United fans and, and Norwich fans as well were expecting Norwich to pose a bit more of an attacking threat in the second half. Because the first half... We stayed in the game, but we never really got at you. I think we'd set up for the counter, try and hit you through Nathan Redmond's pace. Maybe a bit of pace down the left with Olsen. Um, but we just tried to sit back and soak up a bit of pressure and then hit you on the counter-attack. Second half was a complete waste of time. I was expecting Neil Adams to maybe throw on another striker, tell Redmond to start running at the players a bit more, tell Olsen to get forward a bit more, maybe Whitaker as well to, to give a bit of help down the right-hand side. None of that happened. We defended poorly. Um, Leroy Fur should have picked up his men better. Our defenders were, were stagnant. Ruddy, Ruddy did pull off a few good saves. I think that was one of the only positives. But Matter, two goals for him. It must have been slightly deflating not starting. He's the most expensive player in that team. And for him not to start must be slightly deflating. But it's a great character from him to come on and score two goals and really change the game around. Rooney, another trademark game from him. Really um, good play from him today. Although the penalty was a bit soft and his second goal... We just didn't step up. We've seen that so many times this season. I'm not going to go into it because I'm going to get myself frustrated. Awful defending for Rooney's second goal. I just can't comprehend how them players can think that's acceptable to step off that much. But anyway, good win for you guys. Let me know in the comments below if you want Europa League football this year. Do you want Ryan Giggs as your permanent manager as well? Very interesting. If you've enjoyed this video, please come over and follow me on Twitter at Talk Norwich City, And you can find me on YouTube. Uh, type in the search bar Talk Norwich City you can find all my links in the description below thank you for watching Man United fans stay logged into Full Time Devils for the best Manchester United content out there and come over me and subscribe thanks for watching guys peace out